Information and Communications Technology, or ICT, has a huge role in bringing 21st century education in the Philippine setting. Its four pillars of contribution are enhancing teaching and learning, enhancing communication and engagement, improving technology infrastructure, and strengthening information systems. To enhance teaching and learning, the Department of Education, in collaboration with the Basic Education Sector Transformation Program, or BEST, conducted trainings to build the ICT skills of teachers. The mode of delivery is through Learning Action Cells, or LACs. A Learning Action Cell, or LAC, is a group of teachers, school heads, and or supervisors who engage in collaborative learning sessions to solve shared challenges in a school or a cluster of schools or districts. LACs are also called professional learning communities, communities of practice, and teacher quality circles among many others. It is a self-directed learning process and a reflective practice leading to action and self-evaluation. The LAC is a form of professional development that builds collective competence through regular peer coaching and learning. In November 2015, the DEPAD Curriculum and Instruction ICT Service and BEST program teams conducted a pilot training on ICT literacy skills development in Tacloban City in Leyte. Over 100 school ICT coordinators participated in the event. Three months after the training, the BEST team went to visit the schools with the participating ICT coordinators to conduct classroom and LAC observations. ICT integration is very important in teaching. Motivate po yung mga bata at nagiging mas madali yung trabaho ng guru ko. Kumamit po ako ng digital flashcards. Ang activities namin, meron kami digital quiz na kung saan magmamanipulate po yung bata mismo po sa gadgets. Tapos meron po kami mga icons na pop-up po kung whether yung answer nila is correct or hindi. po, dati po akong uh, teacher sa grade 1. Tapos na po kami nag-seminar about ICT integration. So, pag-shift pag ko sa grade 4 kasi nag-retire po yung isang guro, um, na-apply ko po. Mas madali na lang po sa akin. Iksikin mo din yung ibang po teachers mo na hindi lang ikaw yung nag i ng uh, something better to give to your students. So, kailangan tulungan mo rin sila na magkaroon ng skills kung ano man meron ka. Hi, I'm Eleanor M. Alvarez. I'm now in grade 4 in Makalkia Elementary School here in Pascana. And then, I am the ICT coordinator po sa school. After I attended the ICT training na pinandak ni, parang nasabi ko na, maganda talaga yung proposal ng school-based class session. Kasi doon sa school-based pa, you identify the level, what is the real problem? Hindi lang naman dun sa district, di ba? Pag nasa school, alam na alam natin kung ano yung kailangan ni teacher A, ano yung dapat malaman ni teacher B, ano yung may tutulong ni teacher C, ano yung magiging ano ni teacher D, para mas maging, mas ma-improve pa talaga yung way of teaching mo. Para sa mga co-teachers ko, um, mas naano ko sa kanila na kailangan talaga ng lab session. So, dear, it's a really a need for lab session. Okay. Kasi ganyan na yung sinabi niyo rin sa training namin na we have to do something tulungan namin yung mga co-teachers namin na hindi pa nga rin mga special events ng computer. Anything you work, if it's a thing and you were able to do your activity on time because you have one another, you exercise team work. Pagkatapos nila ma, nagsunta sila na dito para i-assist sila ma para I'm not against the teachers. Hindi ko naman minamalit yung mga teachers na hindi naroon ang lumalit ng computer. Pero yung lab session talaga, malaking tulong yun para mas ma-enhance pa yung learning, yung knowledge ng teacher. Kasi para din naman sa kanya yung para mag-i-teacher siya, na maging mabuting teacher, mas madami pa yung ma-share niya. I am the ICT coordinator of the school. 
also that I'm handling the grade six in fields mathematics specifically. Yeah. So, integrate like, ko yung ICT sa akin pagtuturo, uh, particularly on the use of the interactive activity, which I have learned from our training. This interactive activity really helped me a lot in uh, giving instructions, in uh, dealing with pupils, uh, in working with their own, their own pace. Nakatulong ito sa pagmamanage ng ating klase, sa classroom, in terms of my management, because they, they totally really focus on the topic. And as well as to the teachers here, Yung concept namin ng next session is talagang may problema. So this time, yung problema na nakikita namin is yung lockout, yung hindi naman lockout knowledge. Para kunti lang yung knowledge sa sa ICT. Ako po si Lani Astilia from San Roque Elementary School. Ako po yung school ICT coordinator. Tsaka ako yung nagtuturo ng grade 4, teaching all subjects. Yung first lock session namin, medyo nakakatawa kasi yung iba natakot pang humawak ng computers. Tapos after that, yung basic kasi yung ginagawa, ginagamit namin sa school is yung MS Word. So doon ako nag-start. So pagka next session, yung second session is yung follow-up sa MS Word. Nakita ko medyo may improvement. Yung iba, medyo takot pa rin. Pero at least ginagawa na nila. Sa third session naman, Nagkaroon kami ng a little glimpse sa PowerPoint at saka sa, sa publisher. So, yung kanina naman, yun na yung hands-on. Yung, yung, yung barang practical side, yung input na binigay ko sa una, medyo takot. Kasi, ay, ayaw na namin yun kasi tanda na kami. Mag-retire na kami. Medyo, ngayon, medyo positive na sila. Nakakatawa na sila. Nag-enjoy na sila. Medyo maano lang, mabagal lang sila. Kasi bago pa lang yung iba. Kanina, okay, meron kaming process para naman hindi magulo. Okay, yung tackle, yung tackle yung sa interactive quiz at saka yung sa publisher. Pina... Sasama ko na rin yung mga marunong to help at to assist me. Kasi hindi ko kaya ako lang mag-isa. So, tinatap ko sila kayo, marunong na kayo. So, assist yung iba. Para at least, collaboration. Yun na, patience. Bakit? Kasi sabi ko, ibig ko bang sabihin, ako, kung ICT coordinator ka, so, mayroon ka ng knowledge. So, yung iba, magagaling na talaga. Nandiyan yung irritability pag nakasama mo yung hindi marunong. So, dapat mayroon ka talagang patience. Tapos, you have to go with the, the level ng kuturuan ng special sa paggawa ng last session. Kasi yung iba, madaling matuto. Yung iba, mabagal. So, you have to go with their level. Tapos, be open na way. It's not about um, the salary that we are earning. It's about the instruction or the knowledge that you're imparting to them. Because I am thinking for their betterment, not for my betterment. As a teacher, maraming maraming kami na role as a wife, as a mother, as a sister, lahat-lahat yun. But then, we always have the reason to smile because I'm a few best.